Welcome to GCRD Technologies Introduction to Manual Testing. It is a core topic for software testing, important topic for software testing. Say, first one, what is manual testing? Manual testing. Testing a computer software manually based on its requirements is called manual testing. See, software testing, manual testing. What is the difference between these two terms? These two are not equal, related. Which one is superior? Software testing is superior. What is software testing? Testing computer software whether it is manual or automation, see, or using automation tools. See, software testing can be done in two ways. One is traditional manual testing. Another is automation testing, or you can say automated testing. See, manual testing means I already explained it. Testing a computer software manually based on its requirements. What is automation testing? Another method of software testing. Testing computer software using automation test tools or you can say testing a computer software using a test tool or test script is called automation testing or automated testing. Okay manual testing see uh, where we conduct manual testing see in software development life cycle software testing is an integral part see software development and software testing these two are integrated okay in software development life cycle we conduct software testing manual testing and automation testing also. Next, uh, levels of testing. Say, in olden days, 20 years back, 25 years back, I think only one level of testing was important. That is system testing. Testing on integrated system. See, in software development life cycle, after requirements gathering, analysis and planning, next software design, next uh, coding or physical implementation, next after coding, next testing, after testing, next release and maintenance. But nowadays, quality has quality is more important. It has more importance nowadays so that we have different levels of testing. Uh, using different levels of testing, we can achieve quality products. Okay, levels of testing. See, basically we have four levels of testing. Unit testing, integration testing, system testing, and the acceptance testing. Testers may vary from one level to another. Independent testers, independent testers, or you can say specialized testers conduct testing at, at the system test level. Next, developers may conduct, and developers conduct testing at unit test level. Next, independent testers only conduct testing at, at the integration test level. Next, end users or customer side people conduct the acceptance testing, etc. Already I told, testers may vary from one level to another, but testing is there in four levels. Uh, ours is ours. We independent testers conduct system testing. We independent testers conduct testing on integrated system at the system testing level. See, uh, in unit testing or integration testing or uh, system testing or acceptance testing. In all these four levels, 
manual testing can be applied okay for some areas automation also applied okay forget about other levels uh, our level is system testing system testing at at the system test level we independent testers conduct manual testing okay next types of testing say uh, apart from levels levels of testing we also have uh, types of testing important one functional testing testing the functionality or you can say external behavior of the system next non functional testing uh, non functional testing we have so many sub categories performance testing usability testing security testing uh, recovery testing reliability testing internationalization testing uh, localization testing etc see in software testing 70% market share is functional testing 30% below 30% share only uh, non functional testing so functional testing is important functional testing can be done in two ways one is manual testing another is automation testing okay we are discussing about manual testing see we can conduct important test type of uh, functional testing manually next come to software test life cycle in which uh, we are dis- we are going to discuss manual test life cycle automation test life cycle is some different manual test life cycle see here we have some phases phases see all testers must know about this phases these phases one is requirements analysis next planning next uh, test design next fourth one test the environment setup and verify the environment next fifth one test the execution sixth one last one test cycle closure see during manual testing we may create different testing documents requirements traceability matrix test plan document we document test cases or before the test scenarios test cases next collect test data report defects report defects and write test metric reports at the end of the test life cycle we may prepare test summary report etc see this is a brief introduction about manual testing thank you